say welcome back to my youtube channel in today's tutorial i'm going to show you how to create this cartoon animation just like the video i just played to you now we're going to use canva to create this the step is going to be very easy and i'm going to jump right into this so come to canva and then go to video click on video and then go to what video so we are using this standard we are going to create a, a blank video so click on this this will open a new tab like this and the first thing we need to do is to get a background so we're going to search for go to element and then search for beautiful beautiful street so just search for that i've already searched so i have the keyword over here and then switch to graphics just switch to graphics and then let's use this i prefer this and i'm going to resize this to cover my entire page i'm going to search i'm going to stretch this to cover my entire page like this okay so you can see i have my beautiful city with the street over here now i actually want to get the boy riding a bicycle okay so this is it the other images over here that you can use so you can see by default the time is just five seconds you can actually enlarge or just reduce the timer from here so what i want to do is to search for a boy riding a bicycle so i'll search for boy riding a bicycle so i think i have some here i'm going to search for boys riding a bicycle so you can see i have so many boys riding a bicycle if you want animated you can see i have some animated one over here i prefer that if you can't see that you can actually go here and filter this and then just select what animated over here and it's going to give you animated version of that you can see we have animated version of boys riding a bicycle and other related images okay i prefer to go with this i'll select this and then move this to my screen like this so you can see i have this on my screen and then this is actually animated now we have to resize this just resize that thing it's okay and then our position is somewhere here so now we need to actually animate this for the boy to move from the left to the right we want the, this boy to move across this the scene or the screen so to do that just select your object or whatever image you are using and then go to animate now canva give us the option to create our own animation so that is basically what we're going to do so click on that and then now we're going to drag our animation path so you can see how this has been displayed so we want to actually create the same thing so just select your object and drag it across the path where you want to create your animation so i'm going to drag it across the screen like this that is it you can actually drag it across the entire screen so you can see this has been animated and the boy is able to write across the screen so if i come back here and i play this video which is about five seconds the ball is going to ride this bicycle across the screen like that so this has been animated now that is the first scene or this is the first page we can add other things to you can see we have original smooth steady so you can actually do some adjustment to this the speed of this so you can see if i want this boy to go faster i can actually modify the speed from here okay so you can see the boy is going faster i can increase the speed from here okay that is cool now we can also add audio to this while the boy is right you want to add some music you can go to element and let's search for probably uh we can still go with boy riding a bicycle but this time around we can just switch to audio from here when we switch to audio you can see bike rider we can get some now nice we can get some nice sound effect to use for this you can play this now so i prefer this so i'm just going to add this nice sound to the background while the ball is riding this sound we're playing okay so you can see this pause at some point i can actually drag this across the entire screen for the boy to disappear so that's a nice way of doing this if you don't want your animation to pause over here i can just go to the custom animation again so i can actually remove this i can actually go to the animation option here and then delete the path so you can see here delete the path i can reanimate this and probably i want it to move across the entire screen so this time around what i would do is that this i'm going to go back to my animation i'm first going to remove this path and then when i go back to my animation what i'm going to do is that i'm going to drag this and make sure it go off screen so the boy is going to ride and go off the entire screen okay so make sure this is actually on the smooth line so you can see this is not that perfect you want it to go straight you can have 
the option to do that so you can actually play along this until you get it right okay so i'm going to do it this time around i'll make sure this is in a straight line like this okay okay so this boy will ride across the screen like this and this is perfect okay that is it okay that is perfect now you can actually increase the speed like i said i think this could be better okay i'm cool with this you can add other pages to as well so if you come you can click on the plus and add another page i can actually reduce the audio to just the scene okay so over here we can actually add a nice cool environment so you can just say uh, school environment you can get something like that also so let's see i want a school environment and then add some few I want to get some nice cool background and then i want to use so i can easily switch to graphics here just switch to graphics and i can get some nice cool compound over here so you can see i have this nice cool compound graphics over here and i can click and then add this to my scene like this you can see i can add this to my scene so you can actually use to use this tool or canva to do entire story video for your kids or even for mature people you can actually do that so this is an amazing background so i can just look for students i can use this for school people over here cool i can just search for something whatever i want to search i can see school girls i can search for some image like that then go to graphics and then i want them to walk across the screen over here so what i need to do is that i'll prefer any image i'll just go to graphics and then look for any image that i want to use so what i'll do is i think i'll go with this okay you can put this right here and then resize this resize it like this something like this i want it to move across the screen and we can go to the animation option here and then create our own path so select this and then now we can drag this girl across the screen like this probably to disappear perfect so you can see this time around is able to move across the entire screen like this we can add other things to this to make it even more amazing okay so you can go back here and then get some nice sound to use for this you can get some nice sound and then when you go to audio it's going to give you suggested video based on the keyword you are using so you go to google a suggested web a suggested audio based on the keyword you entered over here so this is another song old school whatever music i can play this song if i like it then i can add it so i think i like this song and i'll just add it to my background like that's perfect so now i can go back and then play this you can play this entire audio when you are done but i want to add the last scene to this so the last thing i'm going to do is to come here i'll come here click on the plus icon to add another page i don't want the audio to extend beyond my next scene so this time around what i want to do is to get another beautiful street again so this time around i want to use a car instead of uh, using the rider so go back to graphics and we can look for another background so i prefer this i'm going to use this and then i'll just enlarge this so you can add several information to this and create an entire story so now what i want to do is to actually get a car car drive or car animation okay so i can say car drive or whatever card drive and whatever information you want to use so let me say card drive and then i can get some graphics to use okay you can always filter whatever you want to do if you don't want to filter this you can just go ahead and then just use it from here so let's say i want to use this i'll just select this and then add it to my scene like this okay so i can put this right here so uh, the next thing i need to do is to actually animate this so let's come from the beginning here this is whatever we have and then i will just go back to animation and I click on create animation and then create my scene i want to move this car across the screen like this so let's see you see our car, our car is moving so now let's go back to element and then just add just search for car drive we can get some nice car sound or car drive in this sound so let's go to audio and then we can add start to our scene so if you come down here I think we should get some nice one, nice audio to use. I think if I change this to car drive, we should get some nice audio from here instead of car driver. I will get some nice audio. So I think I will go with uh, just go down and search for some audio from here. Okay, I think this car 
drive five audio is okay and i'm gonna add that to the scene okay i'm gonna add that to the scene you can so this is actually showing an ng sound so i'm just gonna add this to my scene like this so you can see now we have our scene sets we have our scene set we can play this entire video and see okay so this is amazing if you want to add some transition between this you can do that bring your cursor between this like this and then you can just go ahead and then see color wipe transition you can put in some transition between that even the transition colors you can do that so the transition direction also you can actually change that and then i can come back here and then add another transition effect over here so i'm going to still go with the wipe and then change the direction the direction of the transition and that is amazing we can now go back and play this okay okay so we have everything set and our animation is set now all we need to do is to go ahead and then download this so i can just go to first go to share go to download and download this so this is basically how our video is going to look like after downloading like subscribe for more tips more it trips more it tricks and tips right here on this channel because i have a lot of videos coming up especially related to canva i'll show you how to do some amazing stuff using canva so don't forget to subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of my future video till i come your way again bye bye